Students at Lone Star College are taking on a big debate. It's a bill weaving its way through the state legislature right now that would allow concealed handguns inside Texas classrooms. Channel 2's Brandon Walker is joining us live from Cyprus where the event wrapped up about an hour ago. Now, Brandon, this is an issue that hits close to home for students there at Lone Star College, right? Uh, yeah, Bill, there have been two violent attacks in the past couple years, one resulting in gunfire at a Lone Star campus. Today, students and staff debated whether allowing guns on campus is necessary, considering that it might become law. It would make the campus less safe. By having a concealed handgun license, we'll be responsible and understand what not and what to do with a weapon. A hot topic, whether guns should be allowed on college campuses. I don't feel like it would be a safe environment for us. One by one, students at Lone Star weighed in on the issue. Only the police and the security on this campus should carry them, not, not the students. Currently, that is the case. Campus police are armed, but that would change if concealed carry legislation passes both houses in Austin. It could help the situation. However, it also can hinder it. Did you see the shooting? Two years ago at Lone Star's North Harris campus, a fight gave way to gunfire. Three people were shot. Back here at the Sci Fair campus, a couple months after that, over a dozen people were hurt in an attack with a box cutter. Concealed carry supporters say allowing guns on campus could help prevent future incidents. I knew I heard about it. In that situation, yeah, I mean, a, a, someone with a gun could have possibly, you know, helped the situation, but I don't, I just, I don't, I don't agree with the guns on campus. I just don't, I'm not for it. That was the point of today's forum to weigh out the pros and cons. Also, it gave those still on the fence a chance to figure it all out. I feel like I still need a little bit more information to actually give my opinion, so I really am not sure. Now, if concealed to carry on campus passes, Lone Star's Board of Trustees would have to figure out how to implement it. And college administrators tell me that was the point of today's talk to figure out what students have to say about this. And that would help them figure out how they will ultimately implement the law again if it passes. We're live tonight in Northwest Harris County. I'm Brandon Walker, KPRC, Channel 2 News.